Hello guys, I'm Aldrin H. Ferrer from BSEC 3C <coughs> So, CE Performance Task 5 CPFSK or Continuous Phase Frequency Shift Keying Continuous Phase Frequency Shift Keying is a modulation that as its name implies can be characterized as Traditional Frequency Shift Keying or FSK Signal constraint to be maintained continuous phase at symbolized time boundaries CPFSK is a memory-based modulation scheme in which phase is constrained to be continuous. It's the same with the base principle of SSK or frequency shift Kying. It eliminates discontinued side slopes during the change of input signal, for example of binary 1 or binary 0. You can see here the oscillator 1 and oscillator 2 or binary 1 and binary 0. So, oscillator 1 is a high frequency and oscillator 2 is a low frequency. When oscillator 1 is on, this will be displayed. If you turn on, and you can see the change in phase. This would be the 0, this is would be the 1. This continuous phase generates unwanted spectrum. CPFSK is a memory-based modulation scheme in which space is constrained to be continuous. Voltage controlled oscillator so this will be VCO or voltage controlled oscillator so this displays the binary zero you can notice that binary zero is here it, it would be continuous but when it comes to one this one the wood one would be displayed and if it comes to zero the first zero would be continuous and and so on so let us consider palm signal. DT is equal to summation of IN, G, T minus NT, where IN is equal to sequence of amplitude. Then GT is a rectangular pulse of amplitude 1 over 2T and duration of T second. The equivalent of low pass for from VT is expressed as VT is equal to square root of 2E over T. E raised to J times 4 pi T of T integral of infinity 1 dt dt plus theta 0 where of this the peak frequency derivation and theta 0 is the initial phase carrier the carrier of signal expressed as is t square root of 2e over t cosine of 2 pi of t plus theta t to 1 plus theta 0 where theta t to 1 it represents the time varying phase of the carrier Theta t one is equal to four pi t of t integral of dt of times dt. Four pi t of t is equal to integral of infinity to t sum times summation of l and g t minus n t. Although dt contains the discontinuities, the integral of dt is continuous. The phase of carrier determined by integrating the above equation in an interval n t less than or equal t or t is less than or equal to n plus 1 times t so this is the state diagram of <coughs> an alternative representation of the three list is the state diagram which illustrates the state transitions in time instant t is equals to n t only possible phase states that their transitions are displayed in the state diagram her time does not appear implicitly as variable the state diagram for CPFSK signal which H equals to 1 half. So, this is the state diagram for CPFSK signal with H is equals to 1 half. So, for the summary and example, the continuous phase uses BCO or voltage control oscillator. This method is eliminated the discontinuous phase during the change of input signal. Example Binary 1, 0 volts input natin sa at ng VCO in phase and while binary 0 natin is a 1 volts input sa VCO 45 degrees out of phase because one of the base oscillator is the reference of VCO and it controls the voltage frequency that produces VCO therefore during the change in data smooth transition of phase and output signal is continuous so that's all guys, thank you.